Hi there, we are here with Phil Williams of Remax Center Realty, and I'm super excited to be chatting with him about what he sees is going on in the real estate market in Center County, Pennsylvania. Hey, Phil, how are you today? I'm doing excellent. How are you? Good. Excellent. That's fantastic. It's only like noon. I mean, you're I know. I got morning. my coffee this morning. <laughs> Phil, how many cups of coffee do you have a day? I've been trying to limit it to like two or three. Okay. Um, and or switching to green tea. Um, everything in moderation. Everything in moderation. That is a very, very good tip. Well, Phil, we are here to pick your brain about the Center County real estate market. What are you seeing that's going on here right now? Or maybe not going on? It's it's a very competitive market right now. Um, usually things slow down a little bit in the winter. Uh, we haven't really seen that this year in Center County uh, with the demand that's still out there. A lot of buyers who are educating themselves are expecting interest rates to go up a couple times this year. Uh, they're really trying to be in a home. The problem is listings are historically low right now. Um, we had 183 homes on the market uh, last week. Typically, we are closer to the 350 mark. Um, so, so that is very low. There's a lot of factors, you know, from COVID and everything that have led to that. But pe people are still looking for homes, so it's a great time to sell. Um, interest rates are still low, um, so it's a great time to buy. Um, but you really have to be searching every day um, and be willing to act within a few days because the average um, time that a home is sat on the market is dropped from, I think, 43 days of, um, within the last two years to seven days in State College right now. Um, and the other areas are kind of following that. So um, the homes are still moving quickly. Um, and I expect in the next couple of weeks, a lot of encouragement for buyers. There's going to be a lot more homes coming on the market, more to choose from. Um, but like I said, keep in mind, uh, still will have to make a quick decision. It's definitely still a seller's market. Yeah, I was I was very intrigued when I saw the days on market for January listings last year. You know, the days on market were in the double digits and now they're in the single digits for January of 2022. Um, so, I mean, it's good in a way. You know, people are, are finding the houses they like and putting offers on, in on them quickly. So that's encouraging. Um, what would you say, Phil, like how is a buyer ready? How What does a buyer need in order to be ready to make an offer quickly since things are moving? fast? Well, the first step before you even start seeing homes is really talk to a good local lender. Um, they know the market, um, easy to get a hold of. Um, but the main thing is to get the pre-approval letter. That allows you to know kind of what range you're in, what kind of houses uh, we can be looking at. Uh, also, if you're working with a good lender, they should be able to tell you your monthly payment, which is people's main concern. Um, once you get that, that's kind of like the preliminary um, way a bank is telling you, you know, they're, you know, with everything they checked out, they're willing to give you a loan. Um, and then you can go start seeing houses, um, see what you like, what you don't like. Um, and then uh, there's a lot more to it than that. But uh, I, I help people through the process to create a strong offer because it really does take being aggressive these days to win. Uh, I think in the last few months, over 50% of the transactions have been in a multiple offer situation. Um, so there's people looking um, at the same homes that, you know, you might be. So Phil, you seem to have a lot of good information and experience. What would be the best way if someone wants to see a home with you or talk about the process with you for them to get in touch? Uh, the best way would be email, call, or text. My email is pw4400 at gmail.com. Um, my phone number is 814-571-9572. You can always feel free to give me a call, shoot me a text. If I don't get right back to you, I always get back to people as soon as I am out of an appointment. Um, usually got a lot of things going on as a realtor on a daily basis, um, but I always get back to people, um, help them any way I can. Um, also, I would recommend checking out my business and Facebook and Instagram page uh, at Center PA Realtor. Uh, there's a lot of good updates, videos, um, and just information and tips on there that I try to update almost daily um, to provide more information for a consumer. Great. Well, thank you so much for joining us today, Phil, and I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. You too. Thank you. See ya. See ya.